Hello everyone, my name is Debbie Bebo and I'm a picture book agent and this is Storytime where I read picture books by authors and illustrators we represent. And this here is my quarantine haircut. As you can see, it's crooked. Uh, I asked my son to cut my bangs and he did and they're crooked. But anyway, that's okay. Um, so speaking of my son, the story, um, the picture book I'm going to read today is about a family, uh, about a father and son and uh, their relatives, so it's about family. And it's called Great Dog by Davide Cali, illustrated by Miguel Tanco, and published by Tundra Books. Okay, so let's begin. Um, I am going to take off the jacket. This is called the jacket. I'm gonna take it off because the book is really hot. <laughs> just kidding. No, because that's a dust jacket, which just protects the book. And look at under the book, there's that gorgeous cover, um, which is a different cover. And those are the end papers with all the little dogs, all the different dogs. So let's begin. Great dog. In our house, there's a long hallway filled with family portraits. I love looking at them, and my dad loves telling me stories about them. Can you see the, the portraits? Do you guys have family portraits on your wall? On your walls? Let's see. This is Uncle Angus, the pride of the police, an excellent nose he had. Nothing ever escaped him. Oops, except for a burglary, some thefts. Uh-oh. Then there's Aunt Doris, the fire dog. Boy, did that dog have courage. Her brigade wouldn't have made it without her. Uh-oh, except she can't figure out why the water isn't coming out. Hmm, can you guys figure that out? Uncle Tibber was a champion, the fastest runner in the family. He was always ahead of the pack. Oh, look, he's way out there. That's Uncle Tibber except that the race is going this way. Uncle Tibber's going the wrong way. He's coming this way. It's wrong way, wrong way, Tibber. What about me, I say? Will I be a police dog, a fire dog, or will I be a champ? My dad has no doubt about it. No matter what he says, you will be a great dog. Look at, there's Uncle Angus. Now here's Uncle Scooter. Uncle Scooter looked after a flock of sheep. They listened to his every word and never got into trouble. Yikes, looks like a lot of trouble to me. Look at the girl, <laughs> look at that little student dancing on top of the bookshelf. Aunt Yuki was small, the smallest of us all, yet she was the one to reach the stars. And this is Aunt Frida. Ever since she was a child, Frida wanted to become a painter. Now everyone can see her art. What about me, I ask again. What will I be? Will I too become a teacher or an astronaut? Will I be an artist? My dad has no doubt about it. No matter what, he says, you will be a great dog. Are you sure, I ask. Absolutely, my dad replies. Absolutely, positively sure? I am 100% sure. You will be a great dog, a magnificent dog. Or a great cat. It's up to you. And there they are, father and son, in the family portrait. The end. Uh, I love that, that story and the picture book, and I love it for, for all kinds of reasons. But um, I think the main reason I love it is because um, we all ha have memories of family, uh, people we remember, we remember them a certain way, and maybe uh, the way we remember them is true, but maybe they were also a different way because we're not either one thing or the other, but we're, uh, we have different uh, um, aspects and personalities of, of there are different per aspects of ourselves, um, and they're all, I think, okay. Uh, and it's fun how some people remember some things and other people other things, and it's not the good or the bad that makes the person. Um, 
that they were loved, just like the father loves, uh, loves his son. No matter if he's a dog or a cat or, or uh, whatever he, he is uh, or wants to be. Um, and uh, if you like the book and if you want to do some activities, if you go to our website, um, it's debbiebeagleagency.com slash activities. There's a wonderful activity kit that the publisher Tundra made for this book and you can download that for free. Um, and kids can make uh, their own family trees. Uh, they can draw uh, pictures of their family, their wonderful frames, and write or stories, tell stories um, about these family members. Um, okay, so that's it for today. Before we go, we're gonna look in the, the magic magnifying glass. And who do I see? Oh, I see my Uncle George. I see my Aunt Amy, Auntie Sayo, Uncle Yukio. I see my Auntie Yukio. Auntie Amy and Michiko and I see Uncle Larry I see Uncle Mel I see Uncle Masao and my Aunt Amy oh what yes I saw Amy twice oh no that's Aunt Nancy sorry and I'll see you guys again soon thanks a lot